Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Friday, May 8th, 2020. This is 2020. I am the drunk poker who tis beer time. It's Friday night now. A lot of your days don't mean anything. It's like, it's Blurns Day, the 49th of April, May. I saw that on the internet, so that made me laugh. Uh, it's Friday, so a lot of people are off for the weekend. Good. I mean, Mrs. Polk works from home, and she's off for the weekend. I'm at the beginning of six in a row, but that's okay, because we got beer. Many thanks to my pals at Sawdust, Sammy, and the gang for sending out some new beers. This just dropped the other day. Uh, Lil Man, Belgian-inspired golden ale, 5.2%, based on their uh, Princess Wears Girl Pants Muskoka and Saison. Uh, mm. Brewed for Miles, which is uh, was head brewer uh, Brandon's uh, Brandon's uh, dog passed away earlier this year. Sorry to hear that. Uh, believe me, I know losing your best friend is is not easy. So I like that they honored him by brewing this beer again. Thank you to Sawdust for sending them our way. Uh, I got a pale ale too that's coming out, so we'll get into that probably tomorrow or the next day. Um, yeah, I mean days really have no meaning anymore, I guess, because. You know, we just, for me, it's it's usually like that, though. I'm usually, I'm either at work or I'm at home. That's it. I mean, it's not a big difference, except for, you know, wearing a mask at work and the, 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 the you know, stay six feet apart stuff. But uh, it's good to go home and have a beer. So you're getting a nice citrusy pineapple, maybe a bit of orange, uh, a little bit of spice. <sighs> Smells beautiful. Let's get into it. Cheers. And once again, thank you to Sawdust for, you know, Surprising old Polk, which is a beautiful thing. Cheers. So Princess Wears Girl Pants is one of my favorite saisons. I love that beer. This is similar. Again, based on the same recipe. There's no loss of body here. This is a beautiful, bright, full, smooth, citrusy, pineapple, orange, um, lemon, Definitely a bit of spice on the back, like that peppery kind of saison-y spice. Um, that's really, really nice. That is very, very nice. Holy crap. Like, that's really... Drinks bigger than 5'2". That is very, very nice. Very bright citrus notes, followed by, like, that kind of spicy saison notes. A kind of cl little bit of clove in there, but mostly it's like a peppery back end with, like, a bright pineapple lemon kind of happening. Um... Order it. Just just order it. Uh, just order it for delivery. Just, just don't, don't even question it. Get yourself a four-pack, an eight-pack, a 12-pack maybe. I don't know if you're thinking about it, but uh, I, I would order this now because it's probably not going to last long. Uh, thank you once again to my friends at Sawdust. Indebted. Uh, if you want to tomorrow night, uh, you can join us as we talk to Sam on Zoom with uh, my friend Ren, Beer Diversity, and uh, Merritt from uh, Merritt's Brewing Spinny. We're going to talk about beer and life and other stuff, pandemically uh, speaking and non-pandemically speaking. But uh, for now, I'm going to go enjoy this and maybe open the other one. Cheers, my friends. Happy Friday to you. That is super duper good.